No, speculators do not always get it right. That, that's absolutely correct. In fact, if we are talking about the retail group of speculators, the non-professionals, the people who are trading from their phones, their laptops, uh, they may have home offices, but they just don't have the training and the uh, experience and the expertise. That whole group of people, uh, which is roughly about 20% of, of the short-term traders, uh, unfortunately, uh, over the course of about six months, 95% of them will, will what's called blow up their account. They, they will lose. Uh, so, so this is a game that, that's so easy to play and it's so easy to lose. So in the retail world, uh, they're mostly losers. But in the professional world, on the other hand, the numbers are just the opposite. When people know what they're doing, and they are following the economic flow of the society, and they're, they're seeing the volumes that are coming in and out of the contracts and in and out of the exchanges, and they're, they're, and they're very quick thinkers, and they're very knowledgeable about all of the cause and effect relationships in the economy and the financial world. Uh, they, they're the professionals. They're the ones that do this for a living, and those are the ones that easily, easily make a million dollars a year uh, per person if not much, much more than that. But that's, so that's the difference. And then just one other point on speculation. Uh, one other reform uh, that we're gonna do with Wall Street is we are going to uh, institute a, uh, a tax that's going to deter speculators across the board in both the professional class and in the retail class. So essentially, we're gonna introduce a new rule that, it, that more or less says, if you hold a trade, for less than 60 days, we are going to tax that trade at 50%. So if, if you lose the trade, there's no gain, so there's no tax. If you make money on that trade, uh, then 50% of that profit will immediately, immediately be taken out of your account and moved over to the treasury. It's very easy for brokers to set this system up because everybody that operates on Wall Street must have a broker and it can easily be set up with a computer program to track this. You enter a trade, and if you exit that trade before 60 days has expired, any profits that, that will immediately go into your account are taxed at a rate of 50%. The money is moved over to the treasury, and then the, 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 the remaining uh, goes into the trader's account. Now, the reason why we want to do this is because like I said before, the Warren Buffett style of investing is very beneficial to the American economy and to Americans specifically, whether they realize it or not. However, <clears throat> short-term speculators distort market prices. They are, they are taking money out of the pockets of everybody else in America, and there's really no point in it. It's, it that short-term trading has essentially turned Wall Street into a quasi-Las Vegas casino type of situation. So, so that's going to be a really big beneficial reform. Wall Street's going to fight it like crazy. The lobbyists in Washington, D.C. are going to make a ton of money. But you know something? I know what's going on. I'm going to make the changes. And I really don't care what Wall Street has to say about it because they're going to toe the line. And that's the way it is.